Good morning. It is Tuesday, but it feels like a Monday <laughs> after the 4th of July weekend. So we're back at it. We're going to go start a new project today. It's a it's another driveway and then it has a sidecar parking. A few shout outs this morning. First of all, shout out to uh, Doug the Mason from New York City of DOT. And that shout out comes from Justin at Citywide Concrete. Also Cloverleaf Property Management from Cleveland, Ohio. Uh, and then three brothers property maintenance and then also a special shout out to uh, Ray Bennett So I got a comment that was a pretty special comment. So I appreciate that man I actually printed that comment. I'm saving that. So thank you for that Also, I just wanted to let you guys know that I am working on the merchandise So the guy that makes my hats and shirts currently he actually has uh, the ability to set up an online store so that's the plan right now to get something up uh, very quickly. I'm hoping in the next um, several weeks to have something uh, out. I am going to change up the design just a little bit on the hats. And don't worry, I think you guys are going to like it more, not less. Um, and I'll let you know when that comes up. Uh, so, all right, I'll see you guys at the coffee shop. How much garbage do we make? Morning. Coffee business good? Sure. Thank you. All right, you're welcome. Here she's going. I have one here. Well, you got one Thank you. Yeah, See you later. Mr. Bomber. Well, walk shut today. Pewaukee. Morning, Ryan. Morning. I'm doing good. How are you doing? I'm great. How's your long weekend? Fine. Hopefully, hopefully you got your grass cut. Yeah, I just did. Oh, good. All right, we just pulled up on the job, said hello to the customer. So this is what we're doing here. So current driveway is asphalt. We're going to widen it out. I think that's about three feet to this flag. And uh, I'm going to come straight up here. And then we're going to add a sidecar parking on. Uh, the customer plans on getting a boat. He's going to park right here. So you can kind of see the flags here. Coming around, we're going all the way to the back corner of the garage. Hey, puppy. A little shy, huh? Oh, yeah. A little shy? Maybe just camera shy, huh? Camera shy. You want to say hello to the camera? It's okay. I'll pop back. You go say hello. Oh, it's actually in pretty good shape, to be honest. Okay. So yeah. are you going to work today or are you going to hang out? So you're just gonna stay here and bug us all day? No. I'm no, gonna, I'm just, I'm just I'm kidding. Get her out of the house because she's gonna drive me crazy. Who? Your wife or the dog? Dog. Okay. I just, you know, could could her. be either one. You know. It definitely could. <laughs> it's honestly, it's a pretty straightforward job. There's not a lot of like technical stuff. You know, I mean, everything's got pitch and <laughs> measurements are laid out. Easier. So yeah, it's a little easy. Good. What size shoes you wear? Eleven. Those are elevens. Yeah. Looks like your feet are really small, dude. I know they do. But comparison I guess, to I guess. But you gotta have a good pair of work boots, man. I'm gonna grab the skid loader and start tearing into it. Alright, sir. Yep. Go all the way to the back corner of the garage. Alright, that's it. All right, guys, it's Tuesday. It feels like a Monday, like I said earlier, but uh, we're on the job and, you know, it's time to make that easy money. <laughs>
All right, so just got this uh, sidecar parking area dug out. Can we chalk this quick? Yep. little 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 bit of pitch so I don't want the whole driveway to look like that right. off. you gotta go up a couple inches bro yeah right there I got Bob bringing gravel so we can grade this too right away super hot out it's in the 90s Bob is dying in the trucks I don't have AC in the truck it's like over a hundred something degrees in there for sure <laughs> let's go see how he's doing how you doing Bob Oh, I wish the humidity go down. Sweating through your shirt, I can see right through. Yeah, and the breathing's gonna be. Already? I'm gonna get the inhaler with me. Take it easy. Hi, Arnold. Alright, me and Bobby are at the dump. He's got the quad and I got the tandem. There's a lot of dirt coming out of that job. More than I expected, but... It takes forever for the trucks to go and come back, so I figured I'd just jump in this one and do it myself. Nice dump, Bobby! Alright, so it's almost 10 in the morning. The driveway's all dug out. Forms are just about set. It's taken a little while longer because there was a giant stump over there and I worked on that thing for a solid half an hour, maybe more. It was bad. It was bad, so still got to load all this. Forms are pretty much set and we just got to grade. Uh, should get out of here fairly early, which is good because it's smoking hot. And all you guys in Arizona, you don't have to tell me 92 and humans not hot. I know you guys, it's 115, I get it. But we're from Wisconsin and it's hot to us, so... I wouldn't want to work in your heat, man. Uh-uh. No, thank you. But in the winter, I want to come down there and check it out. It'll be nice in the winter time. I want to pour some concrete with you guys. So we're going to set that all up. I'm going to come to Arizona, Texas, maybe even California. We'll see how the channel does. It really all depends on how big the channel gets and, you know, what I'm able to do uh, with the channel at that point. Would be in such a bad mood. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Al would be scrubbing up there, swearing under his breath. Bugs would be throwing his hammer. 
All right, we're all done. It's a little bit after one o'clock. We just swept up the road. Driveway's all set. It's a lot wider than it was originally. I think we added like a good three feet on this side down here. And then we added that whole entire area there with the sidecar parking. Overall, I would say the setup on this one was easy money. How much garbage do we make? Good morning. So today is Thursday and we're going out to pour that driveway. Yesterday it actually was a rain day again. And next week they have rain and thunderstorms in the forecast every day, which is weird uh, for July in Wisconsin. We had a really dry spring and now we're getting a really wet summer. So we're gonna be fighting rain again uh, next week, but um, you know, we'll see what we can do. So, all right, I will see you guys at the coffee shop. Morning, Scott. How are you this fine morning? Doing good. Coffee business doing well? Always does well. How are you doing today? Good. So what's going on with those? What do you mean? Your fingernails. They're painted. Good. Thank you. All right. You're all set. Have yep. A good day. Yep. You too. I think Bobby's dead. I think he's really dead. Let's go see. I think he's dead. No, I think he's really dead. Yeah, he's dead. Let's go see if he's dead. His skin still has some color. Hello. Bob, are you dead? Uh, you tired from working on the trunk? Well, tired we we were thinking you trunk? might be dead. I know. I'm just sitting here. Yeah, we noticed. <laughs> Thing's loud, man. I really like it. Yeah. Yeah, she's loud. Is it shifting good? Oh, it runs good. Yeah. That's cool, man. Yeah. Uh, Sounds good. Yeah, she runs real nice. There's a uh, three kohlrabi. Oh, nice. And I brought you my last cutting of asparagus. I should put those in the fridge. Yeah, these pair, man. Hey, Al. One and a half. Thank you. Yep. No junior? No, come on. Was he sleeping? No. I mean, I didn't need him, but I thought he'd like to come in for a day. Morning. How you doing? Good, huh? We always carry these six by six blocks so that truck doesn't break the curb edge off or the road edge, depending on what type of edge you have. Put two this way, long ways. You can go down. What's wrong with you? We'll get up and walk around. It won't be cold if you walk around. Go video bugs, do something. Not me. Don't be lazy. Don't video me. <laughs> Just feels so nice to pour with cloud cover and cool weather. Yeah, and Daryl. And Daryl, yeah. 
We don't have Junior though. I hope we're gonna be all right. Yeah, hopefully we'll be all right. <laughs> all right, so we're just waiting on mud now. It's uh, should be here in 10 minutes. Driveway's all ready to pour. Plywood and the blocking is in. I'm gonna guide the drivers in this time so we don't have problems. It's only like 18 or 19 feet wide. Uh, put plywood on the grade. I know it's kind of a pain messing around with the plywood, but I don't like messing around with the ruts either. You know, even if you don't get deep ruts, you still get that impression where it kind of leaves a lip on the edge of each tire. And I just like a flat grade. You pull up the plywood and usually it's pretty good. So, uh, got all the joints marked out. We're going half and half. So it's 20 yards this morning. And then I, I don't know what this is this afternoon, maybe 20, 22 yards to finish this driveway off. So, but everything's ready to go. All the joints are marked, tools are out, buggies ready. We're gonna buggy that little sidecar area. It's not really that big. And uh, the weather's really nice today. It's nice and cool. We got some clouds. It's a great day for pouring concrete. So I'll see you when mud gets here. Man, this day's starting good, man. Cool weather, concrete's on time and everything. Don't get ahead of yourself. Oh no. Man. You know what? I'm guiding this guy in. I was gonna say, I'm going to jump him. right in his truck. Him in. Morning. Oh. You know what you're doing? Nah. <laughs> yeah, right. How you been? Good. How are you? All right. So, uh, I'll kind of help you here. Pull up and then back up. We'll get you right in there up to the power buggy. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm going to pull you in. No. 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 Yeah, you're too far over. You got you got to hit this tire about right here. Yeah, now back up. Okay. Shoot time. Like 22, 23. That was my fault. I didn't think it was that wet. My bad. Autumn, take this and, and scoop this up and throw it back in. I messed up. I had to get my mess up out of the way early. Look at Autumn. Like look, right look at she's truck. got concrete in her hair. Get right in the eye. Oh, like that. yeah. You're on the team. Yes. Pouring concrete in this weather is easy money. How does a lady pull in like it's nothing and the guys can't do it right? Come on. Good. Let her rip, tater chip. Yeah, it looks pretty wet. Wetter than this. Wetter than this. Like, it looks really wet. 
Wow, that's really wet, yeah, man. Hopefully that's just on the top. Hey, your concrete's really wet. My meter would read that a five. What? This is so wet. Send this thing back. This, this is like a nine inch slump. This is just like water. Five? I'm gonna call. I got a problem over here. This second truck is like water, man. It's like a nine-inch slump. I mean, I can, I can, I can show you the video. Well, guys, like I said, concrete work is always interesting. This actually hasn't happened to me in years and years where it comes this wet. I know you guys in the southern states and you know California and stuff where it doesn't freeze. You guys can pour and do pour concrete like this all the time. I see it on the internet, you guys kick screeding and stuff. We just can't get away with that here uh, with the weather that we have. So I'm actually sending this truck back. They're gonna load another one. So I can't pour this, I just can't do it. I'm risking the integrity of this driveway. If this thing falls apart, it's on me. So I'm sending it back. No, I'm really sorry, but I gotta send you back. You gotta send me back. I can't I can't pour that because I'm risking the integrity of the driveway, the strength okay. when I pour that wet. I already yeah. talked I already talked to Tom, he's already loading the truck. So all you got to do is wash out and get out of here. Okay, yeah, if my meter was reading that. Yeah, I'm not saying, look, I'm not saying you did anything wrong. Right. It could be your meter or whatever, but it's really, really wet. I, I just can't pour it that wet. Okay. So, all right, well, thank you. Okay, thank you, Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, guys, this is just, I know I see guys pouring concrete like this all the time, you know, on YouTube and stuff. I don't have water reducer or anything in here. This is, this is just watery concrete, so. I just can't do it. I can't pour concrete this wet. I actually haven't rejected a load. I bet it's been 15 years since I've rejected a load, but it is what it is. I'm glad it's not hot and sunny today. So they're loading me another one right now. So the next truck just rolled up, the replacement truck. Look at Daryl. Like all time, <laughs> <Shut> <laughs> up. A little taste of Daryl without Daryl even here. gonna be fun to blend we got that you can see oh well, I don't know if I don't know if you guys can see but that's where that wet yard is right there I mean it's just super wet still and then the load above it as you can see it's pretty crispy already I mean I'm struggling to put the joint in I really messed up the timing of everything but what are you gonna do you busy right now yeah yeah I can tell Meeting. Yeah. <laughs> After his vacation, he's tired, you know. Right. Oh, yeah. <laughs>
think he is early. Only five minutes. Five minutes, that's it? Yeah. All right, we just finished the first pour. It went good. Everything blended pretty good, actually. Good thing for cool weather and uh, some cloud cover today. So next pour, we're going to get started here. Uh, hopefully this guy's concrete's not too wet. <laughs> it's, it won't be. That's super rare. It'll be fine. Yeah, it's a little dry. It's a little stiff, eh, Bugs? A little bit. Just a couple. Put like two gallons. Good, thank you. With your hands, Bugs? Money, baby. <laughs> How does the cold joint look? Not bad? Dude, it looks cool. really good. It's like you can't even tell. You really can't. It wasn't that bad? No. You can't even tell, man. Let's see what you got. All these drivers must be playing the same way. What's up? Hey, Why are you laughing like what? Hey. What? Say what? I thought you said what I got. I was like, You're like concrete? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey, can you stop making Bugs mad over here, please? I'm not. Man. He's just telling me. I sent him over there, he's mad. Send him over here, he's mad. Nah. Man. Just keep moving back. Hey, yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Give him time to cool off right. in between poles. Right. Come on. Yeah. Hey, that was pretty good, man. All right. Man. Every once in a while. Yeah, right. How long you been driving? <laughs> 25 years. 25 now. years? Man, I'm only 25 years old. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah, I you wish. You were here when I started. <laughs> yes, I was. That was a nice pour. That went good. Yep. Good drivers? Yeah, good driver. yeah. First one, you might as well forget about him. He reminds me of Bob. Oh, God. He hit me twice with the yeah, shoot, I man. Know, I know. Bob hit me too. He actually hit me twice. Yeah, I know. I mean, not hard, but he bumped my leg. <laughs> I like your little juice box. Thanks. Who gave that to you? Your wife? <sighs> Don't wait for me, man. Just go jump over. It's only foot high. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> nice and straight. Nice and straight. Right, Bugs? Yes, sir. It's gotta be. You can do everything right on a driveway, everything be perfect, but the joints be crooked and it looks like garbage. It all looks like garbage. Yep. Yeah. Yep, sure does. All right, so second load's down. Just, uh, just cut the joints in. Guys are edging it. And uh, we're going to jump on a little bit here, maybe 20 minutes. I've gotten a whole bunch of comments, and I want to answer this question. What is the purpose of the seams or the lines? So technically, they're called control joints. And uh, just to keep it simple, the, the word control, what you're doing is you're trying to control where the concrete cracks. You can kind of think of it like a perforated graham cracker, where you snap the graham cracker, and it actually cracks right in the perforation. Or you can think of it as a sheet of glass where you score the glass and you snap it and it snaps and cracks right in the score that you made. It's the same idea with concrete. You know the concrete's going to crack. Uh, and what you're doing is you're just controlling where the cracks occur. So that crack will occur at the bottom of your seam instead of randomly on the surface. 
it's really all about appearance. So either way, you know this driveway is going to crack all over the place be because you're putting a huge piece of rigid material over ground that's going to move and you're going to have big temperature variances. You're going to have expansion and contraction and it's going to crack. So you're just uh, reducing the risk of having any random cracks on the surface where they're visible with the eye. So hope that answers your questions. Um, I like the questions though. If you guys have questions, let me know when I see a question repeated time after time and after time. I'll just go ahead and answer that question in a video just like I did here. Can you please bring Junior in tomorrow? Yeah. The people on YouTube miss him, man. I know. I'll I'm not kidding. Him. Everybody's asking me all the time in the comments, where's Daryl Jr.? Where's Daryl Jr.? I'll bring him in tomorrow. You better bring him in, man. I will. I don't care if he just sleeps behind the truck. Everybody wants to see him. They miss him, <laughs> especially bugs. <laughs> no comment. No comment. Are you still cold? Come on. It's not that cold. I love this weather for working, man. I've been working this all year. Love it. Some guy on YouTube comments yesterday. He said, do you even know how to finish? I was like, excuse me? <laughs> wow. You good, brother? <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> I don't know. Well, he always sees you guys out on the slab. He doesn't see me. So he assumed I didn't know how to finish. I was like, come on, man. How's it going? Yeah, go ahead. How do you guys do a flame out like a circular pad? Uh, a perfect circle, you just get your center point and then you just take your tape measure. If it's a 12, if it's like a 12 foot diameter circle, you go out six foot and you just, just keep measuring six foot all the way around right off that center pin. You just pound a stake right in the center and just swing all the way around. Oh, we use, well, if you don't have forms like we have professional forms, you can use quarter inch masonite. You rip it down to four inches, use that, it bends, it holds the concrete, it works really good. And then you don't have to spend a lot of money on concrete forms if you're not going to use it a bunch of times, you know. So just get a four by eight sheet of quarter inch masonite and rip it to four inches and you're all set. Awesome. Yep. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Why are you smoking? I don't know. <laughs>
That's so bad for you, man. You want to end up like your father-in-law or your stepfather, I mean? No. You'd be like Bobby in a few years. Yeah, right. Did you turn the spigot off? Yeah, of course I turned it off. All right. <laughs> you tired? Yeah, no, I am. Yeah, are you? I'm not yeah. tired at all. I feel like we just started. Oh, that was a lot of work. Concrete's not, not a really. lot of work. It was easy. Easy. <laughs> yeah, concrete is easy, Mark. I mean, once you start finishing stuff and then the music comes on, oh, yeah. you know, and, you, and then you go really fast, it's so easy. Yeah. Pretty big driveway. What was it? That was 16 and 19. 35 yards? Yeah, 35 yards. We could have actually did this in one four, but I don't want to make it that easy, you know. I wanted to break it up and at least give the guy some hours, you know, and waste a little of my money. Right? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. That would have been right on the edge of what we can handle, 35 yards. So we pour seven bay. You like it? Absolutely. Yeah. Fantastic. Right, thank you for the work. I appreciate it. You I appreciate it too. Let's kick some. Looks good though, man. No, it looks really, really good. Yeah. I bet you can't wait to put your boat on and have all this extra room over there. <laughs> That's going to be nice, man. Then you can even pull cars over there and still be able to skate by with other cars. Uh huh. No, it's so. fantastic looking. Yeah, it turned out really good. You guys did a really good job. He likes it. That's good. good cool. Thank you, man. All right. I'll be well, in touch. Yeah, we'll see you on YouTube. Absolutely. All right. All right. Nice to meet you. Oh, Take are care. you going to be home a little later? Yeah. You are? Cause I got a little present for you. So when I first met you, like I looked into your eyes and I could see that there was something missing in your life. Oh, so boy. I think I'm gonna fulfill that thing that's missing in your life. So I'll be back a little later. Okay. I forgot your present, but I'm gonna come back later. So, all right, just give me about a hour, I would say, and I'll be hour? back. All okay, right, yep. I'll hang around for all an hour. All right, sounds sure. good. See you later, all right. man. Take care of you. Yep. All right, so we're all done. Uh, customer's happy, real nice guy. So driveway turned out great. Nice straight joints. Hard at times. Yeah, it's easy money, really. I mean, I don't tell my customers this, but I would honestly do this for free just because I love it. Oh, but I appreciate the money, too. Let me cancel that check. Then. Yeah. <laughs> no, please don't. <laughs> no, no. So I'm not going to walk all the way out because it's a lot of the same thing. But you can see nice straight joints. We didn't have any problem blending that. It blended in really good because we had the right weather for it. If it would have been hot and sunny, we would have had a big problem up there. <laughs> so this is what you needed in your life huh? oh <laughs> look at that oh those are nice you needed some work boots oh hell yeah look at those bad boys these are actually the same boots that i wear man i love these boots these are honestly the most comfortable boots you'll ever wear dude i like that you probably wonder why now it's probably clicking while it i asked is. you how big your feet were the day i hell met yeah. you size 11 dude oh outstanding <laughs> yeah thank you hell again yeah. yeah i appreciate that yeah you're these welcome these will be so all right we're all done. We got another driveway to pour tomorrow. So I will see you guys in the morning. Adios.